What's up guys, welcome to your 13th Python tutorial, and in this tutorial I'm going to be talking to you guys about something called slicing. Now, what slicing is, is it pretty much allows you to put um, multiple elements in a list or a sequence at the same time, without having to do it individually. So, let's go ahead and make a list, uh, I'll name mine example, and we'll set it equal to, uh, let's change a word into a list using the list function. And uh, might as well put easy house or something like that. Now create our list and let's see it. Make sure we got it right. So now we have eight characters that say easy host in it. And now when we use slice, when we use slicing, we can replace or replace certain elements in our list for something else. So uh, let me just show you. So get our example list again, and we're gonna edit it this time. So we're gonna edit it from four on and remember when you put an empty on the right side of the semicolon or actually that's a regular colon it means just at the end of it and so for these four characters uh, we want to replace what do we want to put let's put some more um, some more text and instead of Haas let's put baby and then press enter to create it and then go ahead and output your list example and now you can see instead of easy hoss it says easy baby right there so that is how you can um, use slicing to replace a portion of your list or sequence and you don't have to um, replace the exact same amount you can also do something like um, example for on again equals and write something larger than four characters such as uh, I don't know, race cars, something like that, and then go ahead and output it again, and now you can see your, uh, uh, what's it called, sequence has more than just eight characters, so you don't have to just do it the exact same amount, you can do it however much amount you want. Um, another thing that I want to show you guys is how to add elements in the middle of your list, just replace them on either end. So go ahead and let's, uh, let's uh, recreate our example and actually let's make this entire new one put mm, 789 or something so we, now we have a short little list that's 789 now if we want to add elements directly to the middle of this list or sequence what we have to do is go ahead and type the name of our list type where we want to add the elements so I'm gonna name mine so I'm gonna excuse me add mine um, pretty much before this one when when you use the same numbers so before the first one remember it's zero zero one so if you say alright first first this means after the first one and uh, well this is what it means you'll see why in a little bit now you have to put equals and what do you want to add there well I want to add just three 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 just so I can show you guys so this is saying alright I want to add this little string of sequence right before the first um, element in our list. So go ahead and press enter, then output it, and it says 7 right there, 333, three, three, which is this, 89 to the end of it. So that's how you can use slicing to insert a mini sequence into a larger sequence to create, to create an ultimate bigger one. Um, I guess the last thing I want to show you guys is pretty much the opposite of this how do you get rid of this and one way is to use the delete function but you can also use uh, slicing to do this so let's go ahead and write our example again and we want to be working with the characters one which is means include one remember that first one is inclusive so this is zero this is one and let's see two three four five Remember, when you put 5 right here, it doesn't include this one. So it's going to do 1 to 4. So what do we want to do with that? I told you guys I would delete them. And all you have to do to do that is add an empty element like that. And once you press enter and output it, instead of just 7 blank 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 9, it has 7 9. And that's how you can delete elements in a list using slicing. So that's all I have for you this tutorial. Uh, don't forget to check out my next tutorial. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. So thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you guys next time.